So we really didn't know what we were doing um, when we started. We didn't know which direction we were going, how it was going to be created, because it was really built from the ground up for us by Continue Care, by Era and Alex. Um, uh, we get to know them with very, very well in a very short amount of time because we had so many questions. Um, and what it started out with was us literally just taking photos of our pen and paper systems, sending it to the team and saying, how can you make this work for us and make it digital? And and they were able to crush it because we have such a user-friendly system now. Our residents are able to use it on their own. Um, you know, it's if we message them and say, you know, we're getting some complaints that the, the font is too small. It's like instantly it's like, OK, font is up now. So it's bigger. You can read it easier. Um, so they're so, so responsive to any of our um, suggestions or, you know, any any problems that we're having. They seem to have a solution for it. Um, just last week, actually, in one of our larger communities in Aurora, we discovered the need for a reservation system, a proper reservation system. Nothing like that has been created yet. So we found a way to use an existing interface within the activity platform to let the dining room use it, create their own event, whereas it was really just a reservation. So we were actually able to get like double usage out of the same interface that was already created. So it didn't take any extra time on their part. It didn't, um, it was just basically flipping a switch and allowing them access to our part of the of the program. And we were able to use it to make our dining room even more efficient than it already is using the system. So we have had no issues working with the team and we have lots of um, great ideas moving forward that I'm sure um, everyone else will benefit from as well. <laughs>